Here you go, one bag of premium sea blend. These just came in. They're called cat eyes. The kitties love them. Ooh. Maurice, darling, any specials today? In the back, Natalia. Hey, isn't that the cat lady? The one who takes in all the strays? What a lovely pussy kid. Be careful. Fang doesn't always like strangers. Nonsense. He's a sweetie pie. I've never seen him that friendly before. That's 84 cans at 30% off. Comes to a total of $124.99. I'll give you $74.26. Can you put the rest on my tab? Sorry, Natalia. We'd like to help, but we just can't afford to anymore. Your tab is over $600. But our arrangement used to be so perfect. Oh, it's a shame. My vampire senses are tingling. Hey! Bang, come back here! Home for cats needed. She must be running out of space. Look out! A black cat across our path. Sasha, darling. I guess she doesn't mind the bad luck. She's as graceful as a cat. Fang, come back here. Fluffy, what's the matter with you? See that? Fancy! Fang, come on. Fang! all the commotion. Uh, not another cat fight. Fang just ran off with a demon cat. Don't worry. He'll be fine. Cats just like to explore at night. It's, uh, it's a cat thing. Well, look who's here. That's strange. Premium blend is his favorite. In local news, the mayor is calling an emergency town council meeting to discuss the alarming rise in the cat population. More on that in a moment. Let's go to the emergency town meeting, Dad. We've got to find out what's going on with the cats. But it's Saturday. <laughs> when we got here as fast as we could, be assured that the city is taking the cat situation very seriously. And on a lighter note, don't forget the annual Friends of the Town sushi dinner tomorrow night outside City Hall. My garbage was ripped open every day this week. This morning, I found a furball in my coffee cup. My Blitzy is afraid to go outside. Enough! I've heard enough! We desperately need funding for the stray cats. I have no more money to feed them, so they will look for food on the streets. It's impossible for me without the support of the city. Uh, <laughs> cats uh, are just not in the budget. Uh, I'm sorry. Sorry? You'll all be sorry. Things will get worse. Soon all of the cats will be out on the street all of the time. to be 
be around here. Natalia has them under her control. Fang! Where are you? Natalia sure seemed angry at the meeting. I don't blame her. The town doesn't care a bit about cats. <gasps> The time has come for us to take over this town. The town will pay for their negligence. Fluffy, steal all the milk from front porches. Cranberry, knock over the garbage cans. Petty, scratch up the street signs. She even has a tail. She's a total demon cat lady. Poor Fang, he's changing too. Humans, get them! Then in nice kitties. Hey, look, a mouse! We'll get Fang later. We better warn the mayor. Oh, yes. Can't it wait? I'm in the middle of a very important Tunis a, a budget a meeting. Sorry, Mayor Rosenbaum. There's a demon cat lady emergency. Unless you give her funding, she and her cat clan will destroy the town. Very interesting, but I really don't see a problem oh. we can't handle. Now, if you'll excuse me. <gasps> hey, shoo! That's my tuna special. I'll take care of this cat problem. It was the last thing I do. Uh, yes, uh, uh, Officer Hawcroft, I want this cat problem under control pronto. Oh, and you never RSVP the friends of the town sushi dinner. Hey, isn't that thing? <laughs> <laughs> Get them away from me! Get back here, you little... <laughs> the mayor wants this situation under wraps before the friends of the town sushi dinner. Did he say sushi dinner? Sushi is fish. Cats love fish. I bet that's where the cat lady is going to invade. We're going. But I don't like sushi! Oh, wow. This is cool. Something tells me a rubber chicken isn't going to help us. What about a nice cat kit? Complete with catnip, a spiral wand, and enough bouncy balls to last a lifetime. We'll, we'll take, take it. it! I wish that man would get here. Look! So sorry if you'll have to spoil the fun. Come, my pets! It's dinner time. I want you to return Fang to me. Now why would I do that? Finders, keepers, losers, neighbors! You'll all be so sorry. Take that! Catnip! <laughs> I love catnip! Come, my pets! Stop right there! Keep your claws where I can see them! Snack time, kitties! Way to go, Zapman! I thought some milk might come in handy! Oh! Cream blob! My Zapparab is blocked! Oh, Fang! Thanks, Fang. I knew you cared. Here, I got you something. The cat toy is reversing the demon polarity. Fang's getting normal. We have to use this on the cat lady. Princess Giant! To Zapman! Here, kitty kitty Natalia, have a cat toy! Eat! Eat! So beautiful! Thank you all for coming this evening to the annual Friends of the Town Sushi Dinner. Wow, a very
very good way to get your point across, Mr. Mayor. To let the people see how hungry the cats are? Huh? Oh, oh, oh yes, yes, right. Uh, I planned this catastrophe <laughs> in order to uh, show the severity of the cat problem and to pledge my new commitment to fund Miss Natalia's cat shelter. We can't ignore our responsibility. The place looks great, Natalia. Thanks to you, Mona, and Charlie, and Lily. Hey, the Just Kidding Festival is in the park all weekend long. Comedy acts, pony rides, and clowns. C -c -c clowns Charlie, are you still afraid of clowns? Uh, oh, well, well, what if I am? Maybe I just don't like clowns. How could anyone not like clowns? What did they ever do to you? Yay! Happy, Happy birthday, birthday, Charlie! Blow out all the candles and you'll get a big surprise! <gasps> <laughs> Look! He's gonna cry! <laughs> the horror! The horror! You're suffering from clownophobia, an irrational fear of clowns. I know exactly what you need. Charlie? Come on, Charlie? There's a clown. Go make friends. Nah, he's eating. I'll come back later. You have to confront your fear. What's the worst that can happen? And that's what I'm worried about. Uh, hello there, Mr. Clown. Uh, nice weather we're having. for my irrational fears. That was no ordinary clown. There's something strange going on. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> there he is! Uh -huh. <laughs> that clown gets his jollies by making people miserable. We have to find a way to stop him. Looks like the music is driving him crazy. He's transforming into something else. The door's locked. Children, my name is Luciano Mortadella. I'm so happy to have my young fans visiting me. Well, sir, there's a crazy clown who just went inside. Okay. But I'm all alone, children. See for yourselves. You children like opera, yes? Listen, they're playing my performance in Rigoletto. Who are they? Ah, yes, my parents. Simple circus folk. But I ran away from the circus when I was a little bambino to join the opera. La donna immobile. Sorry we disturbed you, Mr. Mortadella. You come to my grand performance in the park tomorrow, see? I don't get it. How could a clown just vanish into thin air? Maybe he's an invisible clown. Maybe he's following us right now. That's it. The clown never left. He just transformed back into his human form. Mr. Mortadella is a werewolf? Correction, a were clown. I should have guessed when I saw the picture of his parents. Half wolf man, half clown. It's obvious. There it is. 
the Wear Clown. The Wear Clown thrives on the misery and misfortune of others. It says that they used to transform at the strike of noon on medieval festive days. And they remained that way until something appealed to their human side. So that's why the Wear Clown reacted that way to opera music. It's the love of Mr. Mortadella's life. Hey, the encyclopedia says that a wear clown can infect others if it feels threatened. Infect? I don't want to become a snarling creep. You mean like a bite or something? I bet he uses a squirting flower or a hand buzzer to infect his victims. Don't worry, we can help him break the curse that haunts him. Children, how good of you to come. You are my only audience. Don't feel badly. I'm sure other people will arrive soon. It's nice of you to say, but people do not care for opera. What they want is la comedia, to laugh. Maybe you could do a stand-up act. And give up opera? How could I? It is my life. A music is what separates a man from the beasts. Oh! Excuse me, children. Quick, it's noon. He's about to transform. Oh! Okay, Charlie, play the music to turn him back into human form. Becoming Mr. Mortadella again. Macho man, I'm a macho man. I work. Mm, I was playing around last night. I guess I used the wrong tape. <laughs> it's having the opposite effect. He's becoming worse than ever. Why are we chasing him? Shouldn't we be running the other way? Remember what the encyclopedia said? He can turn people into wear clowns by infecting them. <laughs> Officer Halcroft, are you okay? Just a little hand buzzer, children. I feel fine. In fact, I feel great. <laughs> the wear clown infected him with his hand buzzer. <laughs> Stop that clown! What? Would we want to do that, Mona? We're having fun! <laughs> Won't you children join us? <laughs> hey, Bones! <laughs> the work clown is turning the entire town into maniacal goons! It says here that people who were infected remain that way until the original wear clown regains his human form. We have to find him, or by tomorrow, the entire town will be filled with creepy, chuckling, floppy shoe clowns. Come on, let's hustle. Shh, listen. I don't like the sound of this. Who's supposed to be following who? Charlie, are you all right? Uh, I never thought dessert could be used as a diabolical weapon. He went in there. Chuckles Family Steakhouse Circus. Hmm, the obvious choice for a wear clown. Uh, uh, guys, I haven't been in this place since, uh, you know, the clown incident when I was little. There must be a light switch. Try to surround him. I know you're in there. Come out. <gasps> huh? <laughs> Lily, was that you? Yuck, this cotton candy tastes awful. <laughs> <laughs> Look, he's gonna cry. Not this time, I won't. 
the opera. It's my life. What has become of me? Forced to work as a clown to pay the rent. Maybe you transform into a were-clown because you're not fulfilling your love for opera. What if you combined being a clown with opera? Do you think I can be a clown and a famous opera singer as well? I can relate to. Figaro! Figaro! <laughs> <laughs> 